Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Molt. So happy to be here with you guys as always. And one thing that y'all can see that is different about me besides my haircut is these new glasses. You can see uh, the yellow lens on them as I look through them. Uh, I sit at the screen for a very, very long time during the day, and my eyes honestly get tired. Like, they're tired now that I've taken these off. Um, but these are gunner glasses. Um, I picked out these blue ones just because, I don't know, I thought they were cool and interesting. Um, but even just putting these back on, my eyes feel a lot better. Um, I'm not going to do a full review on these right now, but eventually I'm going to uh, for you guys to try out. Uh, they're for gaming and for sitting at the computer for a long time. Your eyes don't get as tired. You feel a lot more rested. Um, so that's why I'm wearing these right now, and that's why they have these yellow lenses, because the yellow lenses help with um, with your eyes being rested. But I know you're going to see a lot of reflections in them and, and whatnot, um, but let's just go ahead and jump into this thing, all right? So this is our Let's Clash account, our Town Hall 8, for those of you who are new and haven't seen me post on this. Um, we are doing a pretty good job right now with our upgrades. We have one more cannon to upgrade before it is all said and done for the cannons. And then I believe that all of our archers are level 9. Nope, so that one's level 10. Um, so we still have to upgrade 1, 2, 3. Nope, 3. Um, so we still have to upgrade 3 archers. Uh, and then we will be good to go. <laughs> But, uh, or we'll be good to go when it comes from the standpoint of those defenses because our mortars are already maxed and our wizards are maxed now. So um, why don't we just go ahead and start this video off with a cannon upgrade right there. That's going to be done in four days. So now all of our cannons are about to be done, which is pretty freaking sweet. Um, I do believe that we only have... Oh no, all of our... So all of our barracks are done. We upgraded one of those in the last video. Uh, if you guys didn't see the last video, it was on the Clash Army channel. Uh, it's under one of the supported channels that I always post or that's on the side of my YouTube channel. So if you guys want to check out the Clash Army, go ahead and do that. There's a bunch of us on there. Um, Noteworthy Games is on there. Uh, Teach Boom Beach is on there. Nick from Teach Boom Beach. Uh, King is on there. Brian is on there. Madden's on there. So on and so forth. So definitely go check out that channel. Um, and you can see my last Clash Army, uh, or my last, my last Let's Clash video on there. And I'm also going to be posting a video on there this afternoon. Wednesdays is my day, so every Wednesday I post on that channel. So definitely go check that out. It's also in the link in the description. Um, but we just finished a, or we're about to finish a clan war. Um, and you can see my, let's see, so I'm <laughs> way down here. Uh, I'm number 43 in this whole thing, and I think that, let me see who I attacked. Uh, so I attacked this guy, um, because by the time I got on, everyone else had already been attacked. Uh, let's go ahead and replay this. I do an all dragon attack. I really wanted to get the three stars so that I could get the loot, um, as well as that extra star for our clan. So I drop off uh, just three up top with my king just to clear out that area and then I drop off the rest of my dragons so that that whole little herd of them will go towards the middle and take out that air defense. So we drop off that rage spell right there, get our dragons really really angry going at all of these defenses. Um, his clan castle troops are coming out but I'm not too worried about those because rage dragons will take them out in like two seconds. Um, so they're just going to continue working their way around. We do have two more rage spells uh, that we're going to drop right there. I dropped that one a little bit early. Uh, it looks like the dragons are above it right now, even though two of them are not being affected by it, which is a little bit annoying. Um, but these dragons are high enough health that those air defenses aren't doing too much damage to them. We take out that one air defense right there, and then we take out that one. And then it is pretty much in the bag after this. So we can go ahead and fast forward at two times speed. Um, and see how these last, well, that one just got taken out. Uh, one, two, three, four, five dragons are going to do, I believe this. No, okay, so that's only two. So there's only four dragons left over. Um, and then they're just going to continue working their way around, taking out these Teslas, taking out those barracks. Um, and then lastly, heading in towards the town hall. And all four of them will take their time uh, ticking away at that to get us that three star in the clan war. Um, and then I think my other attack was a, um, might have been a two-star, or, oh, what was it? 
Who did I attack? I don't think I went up this high um, in the attacks. Where is it? Looking for it. <laughs> we can go ahead and just look in here. Um, go down to me and see that uh, my first attack, yeah, I only got a one star on that, 48%, uh, which was really freaking annoying. It was 20 Hinter was the guy's name. So we can go watch that. Uh, where was he? Did I pass him? Was it 20 Hinter's name? I wouldn't have gone up that high. But I only got one star on that. I used right, yeah, here it is. So we can go ahead and... Uh, Wait a second. Or is that who attacked me? Is that what that meant? <laughs> I don't know why I'm so all over the place right now. So I attacked. Um, oh no, okay, so I only got 48% on it, so I didn't even get a star on that one. Um, but I got three on the other one, but it was only worth one because someone else had already attacked it. So uh, I decided to go ahead and just continue on with the whole mass dragon theme uh, I think we're pretty close to being able to research something we can research wall breakers or even dragon soon so I'm definitely gonna be playing on here for a little while and try and get my elixir game up so that we can research those dragons because right now they are just um, level two so but why don't we go ahead and attack we're gonna break the shield see what kind of loot we can get uh, hopefully we can find a pretty hefty raid with a good amount of resources on it uh, definitely looking for, I don't know, around 400,000 total or something like that. Um, <clears throat> come on. Let's see what we can find. And now it's awkwardly quiet. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> uh, I will be streaming this afternoon as well, guys, if y'all want to check that out. Uh, generally start at 1 to 2 Eastern time. Uh, it, it differs. Uh, I didn't stream yesterday because I'm still waiting to get some RAM for my computer. It might be coming in today or tomorrow. Um, and that's just going to make my stream quality better. Uh, <clears throat> it'll make it a little less laggy and whatnot because I'll be able to dedicate some more RAM to um, streaming. So we're just going to keep on looking here. And I guess I'll go ahead and exit out and be back with you guys in a couple of seconds once I find a raid that is worthy of attacking. All right, so hold tight, and me and my glasses will be back in just a couple seconds, all right? All right, guys, I'm going to go ahead and attack this base. Uh, the loot isn't too bad on it at all. Um, <clears throat> why don't we go ahead and just attack from this top portion where these air defenses are just so that we can go ahead and get them out of the way. I'm going to drop off two dragons on either of these buildings just so we can take them out and then drop off the rest of the dragons right there and then we are going to drop off this rage spell get them in here just to take out these air defenses you can see they are about to take out both of them and then we will be good to go pretty much on the rest of the base I don't think that it's going to be too hard for my dragons to work their way around this base and pretty much just annihilate it um, we'll go ahead and drop one more rage spell right here and hopefully those other two dragons will get into it take out that gold storage for us and uh, we'll just go ahead and drop off our king up here as well just so he can uh, help take out those builder's huts so that those dragons don't get distracted by him. And now that cannon is gone, so the uh, our king's not going to take any damage. Uh, we definitely don't need to use this last rage spell. We probably didn't even need to use that second one, but just made the battle go by a little bit quicker. Um, so we're going to end up getting a good amount of loot from this. Uh, and 25 trophies isn't bad either. I'm not really trophy pushing or anything right now, but... Uh, sometimes it does help to get up and be able to get more loot. So we're about to get that last 900 of each resource and the three star on that. End battle. Yes, please. 190,000 gold, 177,000 elixir is not too shabby. Um, <clears throat> I don't think we're going to train up uh, that army comp again, though, because it's now that we're trying to upgrade our dragons, we need to be... Uh, a little more cautious about what we spend our elixir on. So we're just going to barge um, for a little while and see if we can get up so that the next video we can upgrade our uh, our dragons or research our dragons um, in the laboratory. So let's go ahead and see what else, what else can we upgrade. Uh, we can upgrade that. All of our air defenses, well, we still have our air defenses to upgrade as well which are going to be quite expensive all of our collectors are upgraded we could upgrade our bombs 
but I'm not really thinking about doing that at this point. We're gonna be able to upgrade our Teslas as well, so I might uh, just save up my gold for that. A million isn't too much, so I shouldn't be attacked for my gold right now, and it's protected pretty well in the center of the base anyways. But that is going to be it for this episode, guys. We uh, were able to finish up our last cannon, and uh, we're able to get a pretty good raid with those dragons. You guys were kind of able to see a clan war recap. Uh, the only thing that was a little bit frustrating about it was that I had to attack, uh, where was it? He was up here, right? 20 Hester, yeah, so number 31, um, and I'm number 43, so I had to attack way above my means. Normally what we do, especially in Eliminate, is you attack your same number, and then you attack below. Um, so, But that's just not how they do it in here, which is fine. Um, I just wasn't able to attack a base that was as easily uh, starable when it was a uh, pretty upgraded Town Hall 9 when I'm a Town Hall 8. Um, so yeah, but that's going to be it for this episode, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Make sure that y'all uh, go to Twitch right now, twitch.tv forward slash gaming with malt. Click that follow button, and then whenever I go live this afternoon, you guys will be notified of that. Uh, but that's going to be it for this episode, as I've said like four times now. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I really, really do appreciate it. And as always, make sure you keep calm and clash on for me, right? I'll see you guys later.